Next, I used my smallest brush and dark gray color to add details to the bird's eye, beak, and leg areas. I could really see him coming to life now. Hi, it's Anna Mason, and in this mini class, my good friend Jennifer Rose is going to show us how to paint this adorable blue tit in loose watercolour. Let's take a look. I love painting garden birds, especially blue tits, because they have such brightly coloured feathers. To show off these pretty colours, I wanted to inject as much vibrancy into my painting as possible. Here's how I went about it. I first drew out my bird, marking out all the main shapes and features, including the different colour areas. I then applied a really watery layer of the lightest colour, the yellow. I loosely extended this into the wing, tail and leg areas and into the background. Whilst that was drying, I introduced a watery blue colour, allowing it to meet up with the yellow in places where it hadn't yet dried. Moving quickly, I had one more colour to map out, which was the brown branch area. I then left my painting to completely dry. Next, I used my smallest brush and dark grey colour to add details to the bird's eye, beak and leg areas. I could really see him coming to life now. I let those dry and then with a slightly thicker but still watery consistency, I built up the blue colour areas working into the background. Working in these watery layers was the key to keeping the colours looking really vibrant. Once that was dry, I changed my water to ensure my colours wouldn't muddy, then applied some green mix to enhance the other colour areas and create extra interest. And then I began working on the branch, which was now dry, building up the mid-tones. I kept my marks especially loose on the branch as I only wanted to create a vague impression that it was there. With the head and body now dry, I introduced the darkest tones to the painting with my dark blue colour, adding some outline details and building up the colours. Lastly, I made some adjustments in the areas I wanted to enhance, adding more yellow and introducing some purple, bringing the colours into the background. And then my blue tip painting was complete. A full video class of this loose blue tit is available now in my online school. If you've enjoyed this mini class, please subscribe to my YouTube channel where you can find more videos from Jennifer Rose. Then hop on over to animesnart.com where you can take a full length video class for free and find a whole heap of resources to help you pick up your brush and paint the way you've always wanted to. If you'd like to see more of Jennifer's paintings, check out her site at jenniferrose.gallery. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon to help you create watercolours with WOW.